Good to see you. Good seeing oh, you too. I'm glad you came. Like... In Minnesota. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. High school graduation parties <laughs> have rituals. Thank you for coming. The hugs, the games. Beanbags, gotta do it. The food, so fine. Yeah. And the double garage, <laughs> shrine. <laughs> but graduates of Anoka High School have another. Everybody just loves them. Him. Hey! Anoka grad party staple, <laughs> Jeff Nelson. Hey, congratulations, Sarah. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember the first weekend of June, he had 26 grad parties to go to, and I was like, what? What? Thanks for coming. In the world. I, I've been to all these this summer. I went to 175 in June last year. Jackson Hauge, the most I've ever done is 29 in one day. Courtney Garrison, I started at 9 o'clock in the morning, got Got to my last one at 10 o'clock at night, and I put 186 miles on my car. An honor Jeff Nelson Good evening. has well earned. How do you not know him is the question, really. Good luck yeah. naming an activity at Anoka High. I'll be there. Not attended yeah. by the man they call <laughs> Superfan. I'll be there. I know him from him coming to all my gymnastics meets. Softball, baseball, boys and girls across. Uh, tennis. And those are just the spring uh, track sports. Yeah. Not to mention. See you on Saturday. Their concerts and plays. After that performance, how can they not want to? <laughs> when Jeff left Anoka High School 43 years ago. There's me. He wasn't done. I loved high school. Oh, it was so much fun. He just graduated. Super fan. To cheerleader. Thank you for. For every student to come. Thank you for coming. This is Sydney Baumgartner. That's the basketball games. A guy yeah. like that. Carly Barant from volleyball. Is going to get. Cam Kramer. He's a pitcher. Some invitations. Emily Berg. She was on the dance team. This is three for us. Did you like drink some coffee? <laughs> One, two, three hiker sisters have now graduated. And he was here for all of them. Yep. <laughs> all the siblings. Oh, yeah. yeah, I guess yeah, he knows yeah. the house. He loves the kids. Congratulations. Thank you. And turns out love so can be quantified. My trophy that he gave me for his thousandth grad party. Megan Mershman <laughs> graduated three years ago, and still Jeff's invitations keep coming. This is number 1499. I don't even think he eats in the month of June other than grad parties. That's it. It's walking tacos and pulled pork for the whole month. <laughs> <laughs> Adios. Never married. How are you? No kids of his own. And oh there you are, Abby. Oh my gosh. Yes, yes you are. That's amazing. For the 1500th grad party. Just Abby Sullivan, twin sister Alexa. Yeah. And a few hundred other Anoka students. We're both on the corner. Jeff Nelson does his best to help raise. He's been involved at Anoka Key Club for as long as I can remember. What would life be like without these kids? Uh, like, it would be really, I mean, I, I don't know what I'd do. A man who works security. I'm, I'm very fortunate. Overnights. I'm very, very, very fortunate. <laughs> One, two, three. Keeping his days free <laughs> for his kids. He's important to us. Off to the next one, I guess. Jeff Nelson lives to be a party. Hello. To their success. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Boyd Hooper, Care 11 News. I couldn't miss this one. And over. Well, graduation party season is beginning to slow down. This weekend, Jeff Nelson attended just 15 parties. <laughs> that is so nice in this day and age that so many kids are just drawn to, to that man. Mm -hmm. I just think that's fantastic. And just the love that he gets in return must be just overwhelming for him. And there's this obvious pride in the community. I feel like we're losing Jeff's. You know, like every yeah. community has this someone who passes the torch, and there's mm -hmm. a whole pride in that community, and people graduate. Uh, his dedication is, oh, yeah, is A plus, no doubt. Yeah. <laughs> well, 15 is. That's a lot. That's a lot. Yeah.